Here's why many crypto investors are not able to see internet computer protocol currently, but it is continuing to become more and more visible because of the way the world all of reality functions. So all of reality functions, we're really just light waves and frequencies, which means all of us are operating on our own set of frequencies. Think about like a radio or a television where you tune it to a certain station or a certain frequency, and on that frequency, you hear certain programs. But also, if you're on that frequency, you're not hearing the programs that are on other frequencies. Most of crypto right now is on a different frequency than Internet Computer Protocol because most of crypto is on a frequency where people feel like they don't have enough money and then they're reinforcing that by what they're doing in crypto. And that's why there's so many rug pulls and scams and people who lose money in crypto because most of crypto is operating on a frequency of selfishness and self-centeredness and uh, trying to just come from a place where you don't have enough. So therefore, you're trying to get as much as possible, which leads a lot of projects to being created by founders who feel that way. And then they attract investors who feel the same way. And then everybody ends up broke out of the project. First, the investors. And then generally, the founder of the project will blow all the money themselves. And everybody just suffers. Meanwhile, Internet computers on a much different frequency of offering the best technology we've seen anywhere by far in crypto, revolutionary technology. And generally, the only people who are going to find Internet Computer Protocol are on a frequency of I am already wealthy, that I already have money, and uh, I'm constantly bringing more money to me because I'm wealthy, because I already feel I have enough, more just comes to me easily. So that's drastically different than the way the majority of crypto is operating. Yes, there are people who operate and go among all different frequencies. Most people tend to stay on as with radio stations, TV channels, YouTube, YouTubers they watch. Most of us tend to be on a very limited number of frequencies where we listen to this station and watch that channel, and then we're kind of oblivious to everything else. So... The more people in the world adopt this I have enough wealthy mindset and a lot of the people who are newer getting into crypto as it continues to get out of this, you know, early adopter phase and get more into mass adoption, they'll be attracted to internet computer because to me, this is the crypto that if you're on the wealth frequency, this one's by far the most attractive and that's the frequency I'm on. Now, I operated on those different frequencies in crypto myself, and I consistently went through the pattern I described before, where I kept getting attracted to these projects and ended up being, you know, rug pulls, the overhyped, speculative. And it, I finally found Internet Computer Protocol when I got into this frequency of I already have lots. And I just want to share the lots, the abundant wealth I have with the world. And I want to make a world full of wealthy people. There's lots of people in the world who aren't thinking like that right now that are just in this survival mindset. I got to get enough from me and I don't care about everybody else. And uh, to me, that is going to generally mean that Internet computers not going when they scroll through the top cryptos, when they see news because of the frequencies that is on, they're not going to click on those kind of videos. And what I've noticed is lots of you I've talked with in one-on-one -on -one calls and in my open chat, which are linked on jurybanfield.com, lots of you were, you knew what you were looking for before you found my videos. You were looking for a crypto that truly had rock solid fundamentals. You were looking for something that was different. You already felt wealthy and were excited to you know, get into crypto because you could see there's absolutely abundant wealth that is available in crypto. And then you found my videos from there. And I told you about Internet Computer Protocol and you bought it and you loaded it up. And now you're like, well, why doesn't everybody else see this? Right now, a lot of people in crypto are going through the pain of constantly buying things high and selling them low. And this is what happened in early Bitcoin. A lot of a lot of people who bought Bitcoin, like me to start with, lost money because I was in this quick money mindset. But the people who were feeling the most wealthy, they found Bitcoin earlier and held on to it and created even more wealth out of that. Like this Bible quote that says, 
he he who hath more shall be given and he who hath not even what he appears to have shall be taken away and it seems unfair but that's the choice you have is are you wealthy now do you already have enough crypto now are you interested in making a world full of wealthy people and if you're on those frequencies it makes sense that you're here and uh, internet computer protocol is going to continue bringing more and more people who already feel wealthy on board and generally it will be in proportion to how wealthy you already feel because like bitcoin lots of people are getting into bitcoin now but the relative amount of wealth that is being seen from that versus if you got into it 10 years ago and had the patience to just hang on is exponentially lower same thing with internet computer the more it continues to be adopted and the more it's obvious to everyone how it's different in crypto there will be a le re relatively less wealth that is created so right now to me internet computer protocol is on the frequency of people who are very wealthy inside who are rapidly and intensely attracting more wealth to them and uh, that's that's why we're in this and that is going to keep bringing more people in this. The more people get burned in crypto, the more people are faced with having to look at, hey, I got into this crypto and I got tricked out of this because I felt broke to start with, and therefore I was vulnerable. The way I did with my finances, realizing that I, my, I create and destroy wealth by how I feel inside, that drives the outside. So the more people in this world that feel wealthy, which I imagine we're going to keep having an increase in that going forward. If you look at the past, I mean, there were very few people who at least materially felt wealthy enough to have it externally throughout history. And now many of us live way better than the kings used to. Then many of us, just ordinary people in developed countries, live in a materially way wealthier set up way more abundant life than uh, many of the very richest people in the past did so i think that trend is going to continue where this whole planet is going to continue growing in a feeling that i have enough the ultimate feeling of wealth is that i have enough that i don't need anything else outside me that i want to share the having enough myself with other people like mr beast the big reason mr beast got to be one of the top youtubers is obviously a feeling within that he already has enough himself and he's already doing what he loves and he just wants to give and give and give and contribute to others i'm looking forward to i've already given uh, i've given other people more internet computer than most people even have i've given a bunch of it away and i'm excited to keep giving more and more away which i do i give away internet computer just for people helping me make videos coming up with topics and giving me useful information in my open chat i give away icp most days in my channel i'll drop a half icp for one single helpful comment and that is you know that's to me is an example of the kind of world i'm really excited to live in where people anywhere in the world can easily share wealth with each other the technology on internet computer protocol is in position to bring a huge amount of wealth into the world from transferring ownership of these centralized applications into DAOs and into people around the world. And thus, it's there's so much wealth that is in the process of being created by ICP that right now it's on this intensely high wealth frequency. And that means because many people who already are in the intensely high wealth frequency already have, you know, their, their world is already full of that. You know, Elon Musk already has, you know, a lot of wealth. He, you know, you don't necessarily have space for something new lots of times. So Internet Computer Protocol is in this special position where people who recently or you know fairly recently have shifted a mindset out of feeling broke and feeling like they don't have enough into i am wealthy and then uh, internet computer protocol will be discovered it's through what seems like almost magical means today like someone who's felt broke and i don't have enough and changes that mindset to i'm wealthy and i have plenty will then find out about bitcoin 
and through seeing videos about Bitcoin, they'll see these other, you know, 100x crypto videos, they'll watch some of those, and that through seeing some of those, YouTube will recommend them one of my videos, because maybe one of the videos they watch will mention ICP along with a bunch of other coins, then they'll get into internet computer from my videos, they won't even buy any other altcoins, and then that process will look kind of magical from the outside, but from the inside, it it actually looks purely logical. Once once you take this position that I have enough, I'm wealthy, I already have everything I need, you're just like a vacuum cleaner. It's like you just suck all the stuff that matches that feeling directly to you. And that's how I got all into internet computer. The more I stopped feeling like I... Because feelings can fluctuate from day to day. Like the day there would be days in crypto where I'd feel like I was broke and I needed to grind out and find more altcoins and make more money. And on many of those days, I would get out there and buy projects that didn't look that great and put a video up about it. And lots of times get more views than Internet Computer Protocol. But it led me back inside. I'm like, why do I feel broke? Like, why am I only thinking about building my wealth? Like, I want to help everybody. And the more I dug into I'm wealthy... And I want to share my wealth as much as possible with as many people as possible. The more I couldn't stand to hold anything besides Internet Computer Protocol. So if you're wondering, you know, when is everybody else going to figure out ICP? Just remember, this is how they're going to figure out ICP. And the more people figure out ICP at kind of, to me, what looks like the extreme wealth end of things, the more it will get easier and easier for other people to discover. Because, you know, lots of us aren't bitcoin has been much easier for people to discover in the last few years than it was to discover in 2014 and even when it started because of the the level of extreme like the level of wealth you could create by getting into bitcoin early versus now many people are much more comfortable creating a little bit of wealth like hey i'm already wealthy you know i'll add some bitcoin to my portfolio and that'll you know over time that will double trip you triple and value. So the the more people that make that change and get into this feeling of extreme deep wealth, I have more than enough, I'm going to be rich for the rest of my life, the more the more ICP will expand and then the more it expands it will get easier and easier for people who are, you know, for regular people to discover it. So have patience. I know some of you get so impatient and you bought it and you're down a little bit in the short term just look at the past. If you feel wealthy now, you do not need external reinforcement to tell you that. And if you feel broke, no amount of external reinforcement in terms of the, the most broke I felt started in the last few years started when externally I had more money than ever. Like if you looked at my bank accounts, I had more money, more net worth than ever and yet it it still wasn't enough. And people go through cycles in crypto too, where, you know, I feel I feel rich today because of my crypto portfolio, and then when it all plummets, now I feel broke again. So lots of people just get dragged around on the cycles, but if you can stick with the feeling of I'm wealthy, life will constantly reinforce that to you, and you'll actually disregard that which does not match your feeling of wealthy you know for example i have a car a corolla that's like 17 18 years old and uh, some people would look at that as well that's a sign you're broke because if you were wealthy you'd have an, a new car but because i feel so wealthy and i love the stuff i already have i love the car i already have that means instead of dumping all this money into a new car i'm driving a car that's been paid off for at least 10 years and uh, i'm loving it and enjoying it and you now i'm riding around in my corolla it feels like a new tesla to me so then uh, that's piling up money that i can invest in icp and that sits in the bank and then that i look at that and say you know look how much icp i've got i'm wealthy look how much you know money i have in the bank i'm wealthy look at this car i have that i love i'm wealthy so when you love that which you have and you feel the wealth that you have, external reality will constantly reinforce that. So external reality is going to keep reinforcing ICP. It's going to keep magically bringing new people into it. And uh, all you have to do is be patient and feel wealthy now. And I, I don't look at the price of ICP unless you all post stuff 
Like, I don't proactively go look for it unless I haven't bought any in a while and I want to go buy some, which is like once or twice a month. All I look at is how much ICP I have. And I think about what it's going to be in the future. And I'm like, man, this is, I have so much. Like, compared to where, you know, thinking into the future, like having thousands of ICP in the future is going to be, you know, like having hundreds of Bitcoin is right now. And while I couldn't see that in 2014 with Bitcoin, I can see that with ICP. So if this was helpful for you, I'm Jerry Banfield. As you probably know, I'm a full-time YouTuber. And on my website, jerrybanfield.com, and in the play in the description on YouTube, I've got all my different playlists. My goal is to, to share things that really matter with you, to share new ideas with you, to help share the wealth I have with you. And the primary way of building wealth starts in here with the way you think. And if you want more on that, check my Thoughts Channel playlist, where I, I have lots of videos talking about wealth and health, time, age, habits to improve your life. You, meet, you watch these videos, this is serious power coming in and flowing to your life. Like these, I how I think determines everything else in my reality. And I also have an autobiography channel with my life stories where you can really get to know me beyond just a crypto guy, which I would love for you to do. I've been through some, you know, challenging journeys in life, like, you know, my time as an alcoholic police officer. I have 10 years sober now. I talk about things like you can watch my first ever, you know, one of my first ever YouTube videos on this channel. I have two crypto channels that I put videos on as often as I can to support you. And I also play games and do some other stuff like make dance or house music on my instrumental music channel. So thanks for watching. I'll hope to see you on another video.